spotted some mountain goons up ahead. Let's cut. Got this, Captain. We need a card to access their floor. Let's find it. Look at the heaps of stuff in there. They really think it's going to stop. Just a quick barricade. It's nothing. Seth? Breaking stuff specialty. I'm on it. Huh? Oh, gang members up ahead. All you day sharp. The thing to teach these young a lesson. Allow me. My turn. Are you ready to handle it? Ready for the showdown?
think you can handle me. You face now? Prepare! The face judgment! <laughs> Check out the cake. Stop her stick. <laughs> 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 Way too boring. All you do is come at me. It's seriously putting me to sleep. Listen up, you scumbag. I'm gonna beat you fair and square. I believe in resorting to cheap tricks. <laughs> oh, really? That's too bad. Cheap tricks are what I'm good at. I told you not to wander off. Look at us now. We're completely lost. <laughs> <laughs> Smell etheric matter. Be careful. <laughs> These people are only gonna slow us down. Hubzak is on our tail. Don't make things difficult. Let's bail. Hold it! Who's there? Stay back! Let them go! They're not a part of this! Let go, huh? Sure. If you take that place! Deal. He actually agreed? <laughs> <laughs> See? Told you it'd work! It's clearing. Stay tight and keep alert. Captain Juyuan, we found three civilians. They're all safe. The mountain lions are gone. They are slippery, just like Officer Byron said. Hold on. Where's Seth? Yes, we apprehended all the gang members at the scene, except for Jane. However, two citizens and Officer Seth have gone missing. There are reports that they were captured by the gang. Uh, understood. Our team is ready and awaiting further orders. 
So, what's the plan? What happens to us now that we've failed the operation? Hmm... You're turning pale, so I guess this must be it then. I'll boss up my desk and return my gear. Oh, is it okay if I take my welcome mug? Huh? Uh, hold on, Jingyi. It's not like that. We haven't failed yet. Poor Juyan. You're in denial that you failed. The core gang members, including Jane, they all got away, remember? The operation was a flop. But hey, you tried your best. No, don't pat me. I, I'm fine. The operation wasn't a flop. I, I mean, not a total flop. We were at least half successful. <sighs> uh, I guess I should have filled you in right after the operation ended. You know how the mountain lions are really good at hiding, right? We can't root them out because they always manage to slip away in the hollows, making it hard for us to pin down their HQ. Right. They call themselves lions, but all they do is scamper around like rodents. From the looks of it, I think we should send them a rat to be their leader. Y right! That's exactly it, Jingyi! You've got it all figured out! Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. I might not have it all figured out, but I'll gladly take the compliments. Uh, well, actually, the rat idea you just mentioned? That was our plan all along. Maybe we should send them a rat to be their leader? Consultant for criminal behavior at public security. What? She's one of us? That's right. Jane's been working with us, and she's our inside agent for this operation. She's the rat we sent in. The real bait. The real purpose behind the whole operation was to put on a show, allowing Jane to gain enough trust to infiltrate the Mountain Lion's top ranks and learn the secrets of their HQ. That's a bold move. So in that sense, our operation was a success. And Seth, I thought he was too straightforward to play such cunning tricks. He really fooled me. I thought they had actually captured him. <laughs> <clears throat> huh? Not funny? What's with the look on your face? Remember when I said the operation was only half a success? He and the civilians who were caught up in this? Fast and precise. It all happened suddenly. Things got messy real quick. If we hadn't pulled out fast, some of us would have gotten busted. Oh. Yeah, yeah, boss. We even snagged an officer as bonus. <laughs> now look! Did you pull this off? Um, it, it was Jane. Boss! Jane came through for us again today. She sold the officer to the smoke bomb, and we were able to get out of there safely. You bunch of despicable thugs! You have no honor! It wasn't much of a fight. This idiot tried to play hero for some civilians, like a mouse walking into a trap. Good work, Jane. 
When the time's right, we'll see if there's a spot for you as a trusted bodyguard. Whoa. Lysanna! Those public security clowns are still after us. I'm gonna go find out what they're up to. Lay low here for now. I'll arrange to get you back to the den safely in groups. You got that? Crystal clear, sir! Along with the lions! I can't break out of these. They're just simple restraint cuffs. Don't waste your energy. I injected you with muscle relaxants on the way over. You're lucky that you're even able to stand. Muscle relaxants? No wonder I feel so weak now. You'd sink so low as to use prohibited substances on innocent civilians? <laughs> hey, we've never done this to anybody else. Only you got the special treatment. What? Damn it! You dirty, sneaky rat! It might be dirty to do this to ordinary people, but for someone who calls Cuff simple, it's a precaution. You? You obviously have the wits to match your skill. Why not keep on the straight and narrow? Why join a gang of violent thoughts? Oh? You sound like you must know me pretty well. Of course I know you. I've read your entire dossier. Jane Doe, a new talent recruited by the Mountain Lions. You've rapidly risen through the ranks thanks to your sharp skills and quick mind. Now you're already a core member of the gang's bodyguards. Oh, and what's your point? At face value, most would think you're just another typical thug. Cunning, ruthless, deplorable, and cruel. But I can tell you're much more than that. <laughs> I know you must still have some virtues. Am I right? <laughs> you're asking me? Let's assume that you do. Because I believe you do. And unlike the rest of the Mountain Lion Gang, you still have some goodness left in your heart. You do, right? <sighs> what I'm saying is, you still have a choice, Jane. You can turn over a new leaf. It's not too late. If you cooperate with me, you have my word that public security will give you a fair trial. They'll go easy on you if you change and help me. How's that sound? You're Seth, right? Hmm? Yeah, that's my name. So what about the deal I mentioned? Hey, you sitting there, the little lady. <laughs> yeah, you. What are you trying to hide there? Uh, I, I don't have anything. Make no mistake, the only hostage worth anything here is the officer. Nobody's gonna cry if you end up missing an arm or a leg. Tell me, what are you hiding? <laughs> Whoa, <laughs> hang on a minute, Jane. No need to get so worked up. They say it's the eyeballs of hollow victims that the rats go for first. And you've got beautiful eyes there, Missy. I'm sure they'll love the taste. I... I... I don't have anything. Really? This is the last time I'll ask. What are you hiding? Water! It's drinking water! We kept some from the trip over here! I told them to hide it! If there's a problem with that, then tick it up with me. Officer Seth, you have an excellent aptitude for ether and outstanding fitness. Plus, you have many other virtues, like honesty, kindness, and determination. What are you trying to say? That you know me? No, I don't know you at all. But you're easy to read. And you've got all the stuff that bad guys love. Honesty, so you're a terrible liar. Kind-heartedness, so you're easily manipulated. And determination, so you never give in. I don't see any hope of us working together. Therefore, I strongly suggest that you be a good little hostage and don't try anything funny. After all, I am the only one here with some kindness left in my heart. Right? 
Ugh, you? Hey, where's the guard? Come here. Uh, yes, Jane? D did you call me? Keep a close eye on them, and make sure they're treated according to the rules. Also, make sure you give our cop friend here three times as much water. And don't let the others drink anything until the cop finishes all his water first. What? You like water, don't you? Well, I'll make sure you drink enough of it then.